principled leaders need to think not just about the impact of their actions on their own firm, and in particular, not just on their own shareholders, but the impact of those actions on society more broadly. One of the key features of the new curriculum is a, is a much increased emphasis on leadership education. In the very first full quarter, we expose the students to critical analytical thinking in, in small seminar groups, which uh, really encourages future leaders to think about the really tough issues that leaders will have to face uh, in practice. Um, we also uh, ask the students in the fall to really reflect on their own leadership styles and skills as well as other leadership styles that they might aspire to and to think behaviorally about the skills that they need to go from where they are now to where they need to be. So through experiential learning as well as seminar-based discussions and conventional classes in all of these ways we're touching on various aspects uh, of leadership. We have a world-class faculty who not only in the classroom are able to translate ideas from management, uh, but they actually, through their research and through their writing, create the ideas in the first place. One of the extraordinary advantages we have at Stanford is that we're on a campus with all of the leading schools, uh, not just a, a leading school of management, but of course law, education, medicine, engineering, and so on. And one of our uh, really important goals is to continue to open ourselves up to the rest of the campus and to provide opportunities for our students to engage with extraordinary students, not just in management, but in these other fields as well. We now require every single student uh, to go to a country where they did not grow up, where they have not had significant work experience, preferably sometime in their first year or else shortly uh, into their second year. And so students go out of their comfort zone to countries that they've never been before. What we have found, which has far exceeded my expectations, is of course the student has their own experience uh, in these countries. But more importantly than that, each of them brings a different experience back to the GSB. There's a, a natural marriage here between social innovation and our students' passion for social innovation uh, on the one hand, uh, and the core frameworks and, and knowledge and, and management approach uh, that we teach uh, in the MBA program. Uh, the mantra of the GSB, of course, is change lives, change organizations, change the world. And one of the ways we do that is by providing an opportunity for students with a passion to change the world through social innovation, to come to the GSB, to arm themselves with management principles, to use this platform uh, and their networks to then go out and make significant social change uh, in the world.